The Air One, or Air One, brings the future of personal aviation into the present, offering a flying experience that feels like stepping straight into science fiction. With foldable wings, a sleek canopy, and intuitive fly-by intent joystick controls, it makes flight smooth, accessible, and remarkably fun, no pilot's license required. Dual controls encourage shared journeys, while its ability to recharge at home like an electric car adds a layer of everyday practicality. Capable of reaching speeds around 155 miles per hour with a range of 110 miles, the Air One isn't just a thrill-seeker's toy, it's a bold reimagining of flying as an experience open to anyone with a sense of adventure. The Volanot Airbike is a futuristic leap into personal flight, blending sci-fi fantasy with cutting-edge engineering. With its forward-leaning rider stance, open-air design, and carbon fiber frame crafted through advanced 3D printing, it delivers an experience that feels more like riding a rebel racer than piloting an aircraft. Twin-jet turbines provide the lift and thrust, propelling it to speeds of around 124 miles per hour, while its featherlight build, seven times lighter than a motorcycle, makes it agile and exhilarating. Though its 10-minute flight time highlights the limits of today's technology, the airbike stands as a raw, rebellious vision of freedom in the skies, offering a tantalizing glimpse of what personal flight could soon become. The Stitz SA 2A Sky Baby, affectionately known as the Sky Baby, is a marvel of daring design and playful ambition. Built by Ray Stitz in 1952 from a lighthearted dare, this tiny biplane embodied boldness with its snug cockpit and mere seven foot wingspan, making every flight an exercise in precision and nerve. Though it logged only about 25 hours in the air, the Sky Baby left a lasting impression with its quick responsiveness and thrilling agility, like a tightrope act performed above the clouds. Now retired at the Udverhazy Center, it stands as a tribute to aviation's spirit of creativity, proving that innovation isn't always about size, it's about the audacity to dream small and fly big. The Star Bumblebee II, built in 1988, remains a bold symbol of human ambition and aviation audacity. With a wingspan of just 5 feet 6 inches and a length of 8 feet 10 inches, it earned the title of the world's smallest piloted biplane, powered by an 85-horsepower Continental engine packed into its tiny frame. But such daring came with risk, during a record-setting flight, an engine failure at only 400 feet led to a devastating crash that left designer and pilot Robert Starr seriously injured. Yet the Bumblebee II endures not as a story of tragedy, but as a testament to the fearless pursuit of dreams that pushed the very limits of possibility. The Bead BD-5 is a captivating icon of home-built aviation, celebrated for its sleek, compact design and daring innovation. Constructed from fiberglass over aluminum with a distinctive pusher engine layout, it even offered a jet-powered variant, the BD-5J, which gave the tiny craft the aura of a personal fighter jet. Though plagued by engine difficulties and a history of incomplete kits, the BD-5 captured the imagination of countless enthusiasts, embodying the dream of building and flying one's own high-performance micro-aircraft. More than just a machine, it stands as a symbol of ingenuity, persistence, and the pure joy of flight, proof that even the smallest cockpit can cradle the biggest dreams. The Krikri MC-15, designed by Michel Colombin in the early 1970s, is a true marvel of miniature aviation and holds the title of the world's smallest manned twin-engine aircraft. Powered by two 15-horsepower JPX PUL-212 engines mounted side-by-side -side on nose pylons, its clever design ensures stability even if one engine fails. Built from aluminum bonded over foam, the Krikri is lightweight, garage-friendly, and can be assembled or disassembled in minutes. Despite its compact size, it's no mere novelty, this ultralight can cruise at around 120 miles per hour and perform aerobatics ranging from plus 10G to dash 5G. In its snug cockpit, 
flying the Krikri feels less like piloting a plane and more like holding the sky in the palm of your hand. The Jetson One is like a flying go-kart for the skies, blending lightweight design with intuitive controls that make piloting feel natural and fun. Built on an aluminum and carbon Kevlar frame, it's powered by eight drone-like motors that give it both strength and agility, while its race car-inspired DNA adds a touch of excitement. Simplicity defines its controls, one hand manages altitude, the other direction, making flight accessible within minutes. Despite its compact build, safety is a priority, with features like autoland, obstacle sensing, motor redundancy, and even a ballistic parachute. With a 20-minute flight time and a backslash $98,000 price tag, it may be reserved for thrill-seekers and enthusiasts, but it offers an unforgettable way to experience the freedom of the sky. The Open Sky M-02J is a one-of-a-kind flying dream, blending art and aviation into a poetic experiment in personal flight. Created by Kazuhiko Hachiya in collaboration with aircraft builder Olympos, this tailless jet-powered glider lifts off with a gentle push of thrust, climbing for about 10 minutes before settling into a silent, bird-like glide. Pilots lie prone in a harness, suspended within a lightweight frame of wood and composites that makes the experience feel raw, intimate, and almost otherworldly. Never intended for mass production, the M-02J is less a machine than a statement, an unforgettable, fragile exploration of what it means to soar like a dream given wings. The SpaceX SD-1 Minisport is a charming embodiment of simplicity and joy, designed for aviators who crave a light, personal flying experience. This agile single-seater, built primarily from wood and composites, features detachable wings that make transport and storage refreshingly practical. Available as plans, kits, or ready-to-fly, it offers pilots both freedom and affordability without sacrificing performance. Cruising at about 100 miles per hour, 160 kilometers per hour, while retaining safe, playful handling at lower speeds, the SD-1 delivers an intimate and efficient flying experience. More than just an aircraft, it feels like a companion in the sky, an honest little machine that seems to smile with every flight. The Subsonics JSX-1 is a single-seat, single-engine microjet that captures the pure joy of personal jet flight in its most compact form. With its turbojet engine mounted just behind the pilot's shoulders, it offers an intimate and thrilling connection to speed and sky. First flown on August 10, 2011, in Oshkosh by Bob Carlton, the JSX-1 impressed with its smooth stalls, steady low-speed approaches, and graceful handling, proving that jet performance doesn't need to be massive to be exhilarating. It isn't built for luxury, it hums with purpose rather than roars with excess, delivering the raw essence of jet-powered flight distilled into a playful, backyard-sized package. <laughs> Thank you.